This is a Schaefer fight song uh, uh, by John Schaefer Shields. Ever onward, ever onward, that's the spirit that has made us strong. We're big but bigger, we will be for to serve humanity. We've the history that helps us move along. Our products now are known in every zone. Our quality unmatched from sea to sea. So it's ever onward, ever onward, for the ever onward Schaefer Company. How are you? Good. How's the fight doing? Good. Truthfully, it's not about making money for us. It's about providing li improved lives for all the people that we work with. So that's when, when John put this into trust, into stock, and stock into trust, the idea was that we would continue to provide jobs and make opportunities for other people. He's the one with my mom, talked to my mom and said, look, Gwen Shields has passed away. Tom Shields is dying of Lou Gehrig's disease. We can sell this company. In fact, Tom Shields wanted to sell the company. And he said, no, let's, you know, this is a old family owned company. Let's see the, if we can get it to continue to stay in the family. We put 51% of our stock in an irrevocable trust to persevere for the family. But as it turned out, uh, and, uh, and this was also part of our thinking, is that we wanted to protect our salesmen that are trying to build their business in their own name. So the fact that it's even here today is because of John's efforts talking to my mom to say, no, we're keeping the company. They took a huge risk in doing that. They could have cashed out, sold the business, made a nice profit, invested their money. They didn't know that, you know, that Jay and I would continue in the business and be successful at it. You know, my hat's off to him. I owe him a lot. You know, I think that the one word that keeps coming back to me is blessed. You know, I mean, I feel very blessed that I was given enough from the people who came before me and, and with God's grace that I could just find my way into my little part of this whole complex thing. You know, so blessed. Now this is our rogues gallery. Right here is Nicholas and then his oldest son Jacob, my grandfather. Nicholas is my great grandfather. And uh, Jacob had one daughter, Marie. She married my dad, Billy Shields and then Tom Shields, and Gwen, and Marty Schwab, and the others. So we stand on the shoulders of all of them. I was about 22, 23. He said, uh, you know, you, most people would die for a family business to go into. And I told him I didn't want a silver spoon given to me. And he explained, straight commission, you earn it. There's no gimmies in that. And he said, uh, but what the heck? You've never listened to me your whole life. I don't know why you'd start now. Well, that was probably the best advice I ever had. And the fact that he was ready to walk away from me if I didn't listen kind of made me think differently about it. So that's what got me into the business. That was 39 years ago. It's very gratifying to, uh, to have the family, you know, still running it and that we are successful and it is growing it leaps and bounds every day and every month and every year. John's been there for me and, and has, has said, you know, you know, he said thank you to me. It tells me about the character John has when he realizes that it's, it's a two-way street. This old Cushman uh, was built in 1920. I was built in 1925. So when I'm 100, 
uh, the Cushman's going to be five years older regardless. I'll show you how fast it'll go. He's loved by, by all the people here, the way he treats them, and all the people out in the field, the way he treats them too. So everybody has great faith in, what, in him, and that's, that'll be a hard act to follow. There's a lot of people that are really top producers in this company. So other people come in and they see that example and they say, hey, I can make a really good living for my family. But what distinguishes this company from any other? The values that the company holds dear, because I know I'm going to be treated fairly. Why? Because of the Christian values that this company is founded upon. And Dad's the head one that stands for that. I think he's had so much uh, joy out of family and friends and, and company. There's not much I can tell him except, uh, I love you, Dad. Thanks for this great opportunity. The advice I give myself every morning when I get up is keep on keeping on. Uh, life is kind of simple. You just can't, you just have to buckle down and, and regardless of what hand you have to play the cards you're given. Uh, if the cards aren't too great, you have to keep on keeping on. Uh, there is a famous talk that Winston Churchill gave. Uh, he always felt it was the most famous talk that he ever gave. He was then in his 70s, and he had had all these accomplishments. And so he stood before them and he said, never Never, 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 never give up. And he sat down. Got a standing ovation. And I think that's part of life. You just, just can't give up. You gotta, regardless of what happens, you have to do the best you can.